Welcome back, family. Welcome back. Here at Crypto Trove, bringing you the latest and the greatest in crypto for beginners. And today, I just want to start off um, by saying, you know, we're investing in a new project. I found a new project that I'm investing in. And it's giving out major returns right now on the yield. So we're seeing up to 17,000%. Um, on the yields currently and their project is called loot swap so basically what loot swap is it's a fantasy gaming theme decks on the harmony ones network and today i will show you how to actually um, stake your loot swap and start earning these juicy rewards um for uh the loot so we're going to get into it, but before I do, I just want to say like and subscribe the page. We're at 96 uh, subscribers right now. I appreciate everybody who's been tuning in and actually, you know, following me and um, taking heed of what I'm saying and actually, you know, just following my journey and seeing uh, how far it goes. So I'm excited. It's an exciting day in cryptocurrencies and let's get started. Also, before we get started, I would like to say I am not a financial advisor. I just want to be able to chronicle my journey because cryptos are the future. And I believe everyone who is invested in cryptos in the early stages should chronicle their journey and show the process. So we're going to get straight into it. Um, the first thing I want to just do is a, basically an overview of Loot Swap. They just dropped a new article. Here's the article. It says, Looters, thanks for the great success over the past week. We are honored to be questing beside you, and many great things come in the future. Cool. So we scroll down. You know, these are patch notes about the guilds, but before we dive into it, that let us talk about the loot tokens for a second. So we're getting into the loot tokens, and we're going to see what loot you know what's the use case and the utility for the token so it's a loot tokens are the native token for loot swap finance due to the high volatility and new features that will be developed loop governance will be added into the platform slowly over time this is to give us the maximum flexibility which users which what use user cases will loot have cool so now it goes on to talk about the use cases for them. So on one path, focusing on a fantasy game theme, loot will be used in order to play games on the platform. This option will not be readily available for some time. However, our goal is to build a wide range of games within the platform and to make strategic partnerships that will enable users to use loot for gaming. Wow. So. We all know the gaming space is huge and is really coming onto the crypto scene huge too. So I believe once you know uh, Loot Swap actually rolls out uh, their their gaming platform, we will start uh, to see more use case um, for the Loot Token because people you know love games and gaming is only going to continue to grow, especially in the crypto space. So. This is something that I can get behind and, you know, I'm actually interested in. So let's keep scrolling down and, you know, okay, assemble your teams, assemble your guilds. So on the other path, loot tokens will be used for entrepreneurial style purposes. This will be seen with the guilds launch. Users will be able to spend loot in order to create their own guild. And when we say spend, we mean burn. So. We all know when tokens are burned, it usually uh, brings up the price because it creates scarcity for that token. And when, you know, it's scarcity for the token, many people are trying to get a hold of it because once it's out, it's out. So I believe this is a good thing for loot swap um, by building those gills and burning the loot. So we're going to continue to scroll down. At lunch, we we will offer three guild slots. We will auction off two guild slots and make a strategic partner for the last. 
For this first launch of guilds, every token spent on the guild will be burned. So this is basically just showing the dates of the auctions for the guild and it's actually coming up this Saturday. So we will start to see more um, price action and more things going on in the loot swap uh, ecosystem. But right now it's still early and we're still just, you know, creating liquidity pools. So the tokenomics, there is some flexibility for the guild leader in creation of their own tokenomics. However, this is the tokenomics model that we will, we will be using for the strategic partnership guild, the one that is not auctioned off. So you can read this, uh, they will burn 100k loot, uh, match 100k loot from loot swap, uh, the liquidity pool will be burnt, it will be a 2 million max token cap, 4% tokens minted will be sent to the loot swap treasury, 5% Mint it will be sent to the loop swap development treasury. 5% will be sent to the loop swap marketing treasury. 4% mint it will be sent to the strategic partnership that is running the guild. Then 500 token, uh, 500k max tokens. 95% of rewards will be released on the same schedule as loop swap. Same emission schedule as loop swap. Primary quest will be loop. So, some of the key features for creating a guild, flexibility, guild leaders can organize their complete teams and loop swap can help fill some of the design gaps if needed, cross marketing through entire network, guild leaders sell the variables for the tokenomics, guilds will participate in wars, opportunities to be included in guild games, critical updates in the future, guild profiles, guild NFT marketplaces, Guild achievements, guild tips on Discord and Telegram. So we're seeing, you know, how people can benefit from the guilds, but what do looters get? Because me personally, I invested my money into loot. So what do we get? So looter benefits from seeing guilds. Looters will see a direct benefit as loot tokens become scarcer from burning loot tokens and locking up loot in questing pools. So that was the thing I said earlier. Um, once you burn tokens, it becomes more scarce. And then once you actually participate in these pools, you're actually locking your money up. And that, you know, helps with um the price of loot because now that money is stored and locked up for liquidity the another benefit is all the guilds will be using loot liquidity pool tokens which means that every guild will be con uh, contributing to liquidity and adding volume to the platform cool okay so we still see the point uh one percent of all trades will be going to the auto looter which will benefit long-term hodlers of loot. Looters will have more options on supporting the platform since members both indirectly and directly benefit from the guild's success. So we're seeing all of the potential benefits looters get from seeing guilds, but on the platform, it's starting to look like they are more so focusing on the guilds but that's not saying that loot won't be, you know, a good crypto or, you know, profitable as a investor. So let's continue to go down the disclaimer. So this is where you really want to read. Loot Swap has zero control over how the guilds will utilize their tokenomics. It is possible that the guild leader will not take their guild seriously and may sell out of their portion or even rug. We encourage users to weigh the pros and the cons carefully. Consider buying any native guild token as these can always be more volatile. While we are part of fork inception here, there is no guarantee that there are no other issues in the code that might be exploited at a later date. There is some certain level of confidence with these guilds because there will be no migrator script and that the things generally appear to be in working order for loot swap we are taking audits very seriously and we will pay for addition audits in the future 
but this is a risk that any early adopter faces while choosing to pursue investing their money in loot swap or any guild on the platform loot swap by no means endorsing any guild by default guilds will not automatically be included in future games that are incorporated in the platform there will be no kyc and no official legal obliga obligations between the guilds and swap suite loop swap by no means endorsing any guild by default guilds will not automatically be included in future games that are incorporated in the platform there will be no kyc and no official legal obligations between the guilds and loop swap we hope we can enjoy these long-term partnerships with the guilds however it is possible that the guilds will not act under loot swaps best interest eventually we'll be looking into automating this process more but due to the manual work required to add quests loop swap will be limiting the guilds to three new quests per week so basically they're saying is this project is volatile it's early stages uh, you gotta look at yourself as an angel investor me personally i only invested 200 dollars, and i will show you later what the you know the what that 200 dollars has turned to so far but i'm willing to lose that 200 dollars because i'm not over or heavily invested i'm just you know seeing this project seeing the potential in it and seeing that i can make passive income at crazy amounts you know like at the point i got in it was like i think don't quote me it was like twenty thousand percent a year so it's still early though it's still early so i'm gonna get more into it but it can this it can be the uh the rug can be pulled on this project like the rug can be pulled on this project so it's a very volatile project and you know i always invest what you can lose and what you don't think about in the long term because this project is volatile is no telling what it will do in the future but i can see um you know what they are trying to do and what they are trying to accomplish so let's just go down the vision the final thoughts so what they're trying to do loop swaps interest is driving more user adoption to the harmony protocol harmony protocol is incredibly early in adoption and we believe that it is essential to grow to maximize our long-term plan for loose swap we believe that not only the guilds will drive more adoption to loop but it will drive more adoption to harmony which will uh, contribute to the ecosystem it is worth noting that the harmony team seems extremely active and they are putting in extra measures that we think will give extra value to the loop swap project specifically talking about guilds many of our features will be focusing on guilds more than loot swap why these guilds will be the ones that bring success not only to loot swap but we believe they will have their mark on the overall harmony protocol so like i said earlier they're more so specifically focusing on guilds not saying that loot uh would not be in the ecosystem but it looks like they're more specifically fixed on uh building the guild so we will have to see um maybe on saturday you know once they auction off the slots we'll see who are the guild owners and we can kind of do our due diligence but right now it's still early it's too early to call we should just be having our money in these liquidity pools so now i'm getting to the juicy stuff the good stuff the stuff everybody has been waiting for how do i earn this liquidity or how can i make you know earn this passive income with loop so if you want to go i'm on a loop swap loop swap dot finance and that is the url make make sure you are on the correct url because a lot of people try to scam people by using you know um off brand urls and they kind of you know put a fake address and they'll you will send the money to them so make sure the it's the proper website so we want to just go over kind of brief overview so we see the loop swap and this is where you know you can swap out your coins you got one 
one inch wise inch a pretty much all the things that viper swap has other than loot so that's just the swap but i really wanted to you know like i said go over the actual um quest so this is the juicy stuff quest so there this is the name they gave their staking so now we're on the loop swap staking page or as they call it the quest page and we can see currently loot has a total uh, value locked of 11 million and i believe when i first invested in it it was around 17 million but you know that doesn't necessarily matter uh, it's still a you know a decent project and a great project to where you can earn you know a good passive income just by being an angel investor and being one of the first people to actually invest in loot so i'm gonna scroll down right now i'm currently in the loot one pool and i just basically created you know liquidity for uh loot in one and i invested two hundred dollars and currently you can see i have a thousand loot um a thousand or eleven hundred loot and it's worth 520 and that 520 is not including the 200 dollars i invest so i have made I made $520 just by staking my money. And like I said, around the time when I started, it was early. I believe I got in probably like the third day the project opened closer to that time. I'm not sure the exact time, but when I got in, um, I got in at a good price and uh, I got in also at a good level where I can earn a lot of rewards so that's just one of the pools but you can go down it's a lot of rewards you got the binance uh uh coin with the one then you got wrap bitcoin with one you got all these pairs that we can see the potential in you know earning a passive income in loot and it's very still early so it's not a lot of locked money up see the one i'm currently in is four million dollars locked up that's not a lot of money um, for these pools so it's still early and you can still get great returns on it and i want to show you too just some, a simple way you know I, i'm not gonna go too uh, deep into it but i'm gonna show you like how you can you know create liquidity so what you do you want to so say for instance i got three one tokens currently right now so if i wanted to uh get let's see loot you know if i want to do loot then i will do the loot and i will make sure i have a you know an equal balance so monetarily right so if uh one is 10 cent and loot is a dollar then i will have to have the same amount so you know one it will have to be the same amount in dollar value if that makes sense if that makes sense i wish i can kind of show you but all of my loot is pretty much locked up in the pool but you just gotta have the same dollar amount when you swap that's pretty much it you just gotta make sure it's around the same amount in you know equal value and then you can create that pool and i can i'm gonna make another video when i'm about to actually make another liquidity pool so i can show you um the step-by-step -step of making the liquidity pool but this is just a website a lot of people are familiar with liquidity pools but it's simple it's i'm telling you it's simple i'm not the smartest guy but i learned it so i know you can learn it and the pool is basically like i said so 89 loots equal up to 507 pool you see what i'm saying that's pretty much how i can explain i'm not sure a better way to explain it but it has to be equal amount and dollar value just equal amounts and dollar value and that's how you create the pool and you can also you know when you get done you can manage your liquidity pool and you can break them up and you know do whatever you want with those uh you know loot or with the one so me personally i'm gonna hold this one probably for about a year because i believe the rewards get unlocked 
within a year or so this is a hold for me like i said i only invested 200 dollars. i'm not looking to make anything uh crazy uh, amounts of money from it i just like seeing new projects and when i can earn you know a good interest rate on it why not um let my money become passive and let my money work for me um so that's pretty much why i invested in it and i also like it as a project the the future games they have coming i'm not sure what they are but the whole setup is kind of you know it's intriguing just by looking at it and also um the other use case for loot and these guilds i believe they can also bring value to the harmony um protocol and just add you know more fun uh make cryptos a more uh, you know a fun space because it's already just a fun space and just a free space so this just opens it up even more so that's my two cents for today if you got any questions man hit hit me on uh, you know leave a comment like the video make sure you subscribe we four subscribers away from 100 i appreciate everybody who's been tuned in and just been following me on this journey for this past month i i'm excited it's a great time in cryptos hey i'm crypto troll and i'm out of here